Larry G. on the red carpet for the Inland Valley News here at the Waldorf Astoria Hotel in Beverly Hills for the Warder Studios. Yes. Um, what was your favorite? So this year? Yeah. Yeah. Get Out, because I'm in it. <laughs> My favorite is Get Out. We love that movie. It was so yeah, clever. It's a, it's a, you know what? It created, recreated a genre, horror, a social side of it. So I think that that was, you think people can't innovate inside of something that's been around forever. But he did, just by telling his truth. So Jordan Peele deserves all the accolades and the awards he can get. And obviously Daniel Kaluuya is in that. He's in Black Panther this year. It's a big year for Blumhouse and Universal. Uh, but for me, I was very happy to do it and very happy that he asked me. What was your part? I played Detective Latoya. Yes, I was the detective that Little Rail comes to looking for help. Right. And uh, people who've seen it know what happens. <laughs> right, right. Yes. It had quite a uh, surprise to it. It did. It really had people going. Well, you know. But I told my wife, I said, watch, this is what's going to happen. <laughs> yes, no, people didn't really understand that it's more of a psychological hit thriller like Hitchcock. So I think he did a really good job of upending the horror genre as not just a stab and or a, you know, boo, you know, fright type of thing. We were all horrified for him, black and white, because we know about society and their systemic, not only racism, but attack of black bodies. And he did that well. Right. So what's next for you? Well, I just did a um, comic book with uh, Josh Whedon. It's a spinoff of the Buffy the Vampire Slayer series. It's called Giles. People should pick it up at Dark Horse. It was out February 28th, just a few days ago. You can get book one already. And we look for book two, three, and four. There's four books, and hopefully that'll be a spinoff into a TV series. I just also am doing a movie about the Voice Choir of Harlem with Ava DuVernay's producing partners, Paul and Tammy Garns, and Electric City. And, um, you know, writing. I just set up a horror thriller at Lionsgate. That I did. So that's what I've been doing. And what's the and name I'm of that? And I'm on Beyond in Freeform. Play their bad guy. Oh, really? That's it. You're a busy lady. I'm a busy, busy girl. That means you're very successful. You know what it means also? It means that if I don't work, the lights don't work. <laughs> As they say, you, you don't work, you don't eat. Ass, yes. You want, you want something done, give it to a busy person. So I try to stay busy. Right. What's your inspiration in life? Who inspires you the most? My mother. Your I, mother? Yes, yeah, she worked very hard. Both my parents were orphans I'm from the mountains of Arizona. Um, yes, and I lived in a hotel called Starlight for the first 11 years of my life off of Route 66. And my mother worked hard and my father. But my mother, after my father passed away at 52, kept working. And she raised six kids and she allowed me to have this career since I was 14. Other than that, I also am very influenced by Hillary Clinton, who I worked for nine years. I'm her most traveled surrogate. And so I like strong women. Mm. So you should do a movie on your story. You think so? I Come think and help so. me now, brother. <laughs> Call me up. I'll be glad to be here. I love it. Let's I, do it. All right. Well, final words, words of shout out, give a shout out. I just want to thank everybody who supported me through these years. We've got uh, Living Single that's now on Hulu, and people are watching it, new generations. And I'd like to say all that support means a lot. You don't always get the award, but when people come and tell you what it means to their life and how they uh, maybe it has been significant in them starting a career in law or anything, I'm very gratified. So I give all thanks and praise to the uh, support that I've had from many audiences, and thank you so much. Much. Yes. Come on. Come on. You are the red carpet. You know, I'm a little Carmen up in here. Hello?